My mom always used to say, before you leave the house, say prayers and dress decent. Because anything can happen on the road. This year, the Cape Town Marathon will be running through District 6. It's very different nowadays. Nothing can compare to those times. The kids would have Christmas, the kids would have Eid, and we all would celebrate together. You don't need to worry. <laughs> My dad had a movie house. He used to bring all the eats to the house. And then I used to open the boxes <laughs> and take out chips. <laughs> was apartheid and they actually wanted to make this a white only place. It was storming and all the neighbors would come out and wish us well. They were like standing there until they couldn't see the truck anymore. Everybody was in tears and crying. Today, where our house was standing, the land is vacant. A year after we moved, my father passed. He had a heart attack. Some of the people didn't want to come back. A lot of them passed on. Mommy. Mommy. When my children became teenagers, I decided to do something for myself. And I think it's the best thing that I could have done. My son left for work on the 1st of June, 2020. The phone call came. Yusuf was in an accident. He was just lying there and they were busy doing CPR. But the most important thing that I actually learned was not to hold on to anger and hatred. Life is too short, very short, for that. It feels like my son taught me this. 